Hello, everybody, and welcome to Drew in the Moment. Hi, guys. We are here in Disney Springs to check out the fall offerings. We're going to try to find a bunch of things for fall time uh, for you guys maybe to come down on your trip and try them out. We, we might try out an item or two. We're going to see. We're going to see what it's all about. Uh, but we just wanted to show you guys and give you a little bit of an idea of what is going on. What they have for goodies. Yeah, what they have for goodies down here at Disney Springs. So without further ado, let's stop talking about it and let's go do it. So here over at Vivol Vivoli, I believe is how you pronounce it, Vivoli Gelato for your Halloween fall items. Look at these. You get the monster, jack-o'-lantern, vampire, so the monster is a mint chocolate chip shake. That sounds good. A vanilla gelato orange Fanta for the jack-o'-lantern and vanilla gelato and Sprite for the vampire. Those look good. And here at Gideon's, we're gonna show you uh, the menu just because it is a four hour wait today, which is a little too long for us, but we are gonna show you what they have for their uh, menu items. Get anything at Gideon's or not, make sure you get yourself a menu that also doubles as a beautiful piece of art. This is their character for this month. It changes month to month. Uh, but their two cookies they have for the month of October are the Frankenstein, which is dark chocolate, double stuffed Oreos and M&Ms, sounds good, and Bride of Frankenstein, which is a white chocolate, golden Oreos and M&Ms, now I have tried both of them. I actually enjoyed the Bride of Frankenstein better than the Frankenstein. They were both good, but I chose the uh, Bride of Frankenstein Queen like the Frankenstein. So, but uh, you'll have to get both of them and, and let me know what you guys think of, uh, you know, which one is better. Just curious. And of course we had to get some chocolate on the menu. Not actually get it, but just to show you guys here at the Ganachery, one of the items they have is Sisters Elixir. It's a hot chocolate bomb for $14 with marshmallows. So good. And also a mini ghost pinata, dark chocolate pinata filled with marshmallow treats. That looks adorable. Look at that. That is so cute. So this is the Sisters Elixir. That looks really, really nice. Very cute. 14 bucks. I like it. What do you think, Queen? I like it. Looks yummy. It looks very it's yummy. It looks very hocus hocusy. And I gotta say, this is actually better than the picture. It looks better in real life. Look at this. That is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. But honestly, the uh, the mini looked a hundred times like it looked cool in the picture, but it looked a hundred times better in person. Um, I, I'm, I might have to come back and get that. I've never bought one of those pinata things from the uh, ganachery. Because uh, it's it's a little more pricey, just in case you guys didn't know. The ganachery is a little more high-end, but you do get quality stuff. So Maybe we get one for my birthday. Maybe we get one for her birthday. Everything we're going to get for her birthday. <laughs> but let's keep on looking around for the fall offerings here at Disney Springs. And now we have made it to Swell on the water Dole Whip in my mouth Alright, so we're going to try some Dole Whip here and show you guys what they have to offer at Swirls on the Water And to show you what they have to offer here at Swirls on the Water they got the Oogie Boogie Nacho Dole Whip Nachos for $8.99 They have the Witch's Flight, which I believe that's what we're going to be getting today And for an adulted beverage, they have a Pumpkin Cider Float for $10.99 very cool. I think next time we're gonna come back for the Oogie Boogie Nachos. And I'll tell you guys, I'm really excited that they have a new uh, holder for these because before they used to set them on like a little platter that was like, you had to balance it. So now you can just use one hand. Whoa. Really, look at this, one hand, mom. Uh, we have pineapple, pumpkin, and this is purple cheesecake, whatever purple flavor is. I'm not really sure, but they look awesome. But understand Dole Whip melts so quick. So you, you gotta get out of the sun if you can and eat them quite quickly. Guys, I am so excited. Uh, I'm the most excited for the pumpkin. 
So I gotta try that first. I just have to. So we're gonna try the pumpkin first. And this is one of the coolest things ever that they've created is the Dole Whip flights. So you can try a whole bunch of different ones. So here we go. The pumpkin. Can't wait. Oh my goodness. That is absolutely phenomenal. No, it, it really is. Really? Let me that try. is so good. Oh. That is so good. Queen Bee is gonna try right now. You tell me what you think of that. Oh my goodness. It it and mm. understand understand it's not you just guys, this is you guys. Oh yeah, yeah. Give give them a little bit as I'm dumping mine. But the thing is about this, it's not just pumpkin spice. Mm -hmm. I taste pumpkin in it. They did a great job. Winner. And what's the next flavor? All right, so the next flavor, uh, we're gonna do it's purple cheesecake, which I didn't know purple was a flavor, but we'll, we'll give that a whirl. Maybe it's just regular cheesecake, color purple, to, to color your teeth. Here we go. I don't like it. <laughs> you don't like it? There's a weird taste. Oh, I'm not gonna it. lie. There, there's a weird taste to that. I can't explain what it is. You tell me, Queen. I, I am not a fan of that. Mm, no. I, I don't recommend that one. I cannot recommend no. that one. I honestly am not gonna eat they any more. Like old bubble gum. It does hit. Queen has had a lot of old bubble gum in her life. <laughs> No, but no, but I but I know what she means. It does. No, it's like no. mm -hmm. not good, not good. I no. I know all bubble gum. She knows. She is a bubble gum aficionado. All right, and we know this is just pineapple Dole Whip, so I know it's going to be good. But we're still going to try Maybe it. Maybe candy corn. Tried and true, baby. Tried and true. As I'm dripping it, I told you guys, Dole Whip melts so fast. What's the winner, honey? Uh. I gotta say, if I was gonna eat it all the time, it's just the pineapple Dole Whip. I, I gotta be honest with you, because it's amazing. But the pumpkin one, really the good. pumpkin off the hook, a no-no for that one. Um, and I'll, let me know if you guys have tried this. That are, you know, you're watching the vlog right now. If you guys have tried it and what you thought of the uh, purple cheesecake, because I think they should call it old bubble gum. Maybe yes, I don't man. know. But uh, two, two out of three ain't bad. No, no, no. Totally worth it too. Six dollars and forty-nine cents. Can't beat it. And in the fall, you can also get down to the funky beats. But you can really do that anytime. <laughs> anytime you come to Disney Springs, you can get your groove on, man. Just letting you know that. So get out there and dance around Disney Springs. And here at Joffrey's, they have some fall offerings that we actually have a video because we tried all three of these uh cold bevies they were they were amazing the pumpkin pie latte the caramel apple chai latte and the pumpkin game changer and if you want to know what our favorite was you'll have to check out that vlog and that'll be at the end of this video you can click on that video Falling into magic, right? I fall into magic. Isn't that what that means, Queen? No? No. no. And of course, we couldn't come to Disney Springs without checking out what's going on at Amaret's Pace, or Patisserie. I think that's how you pronounce it. They always have amazing things. And right outside, for you Hocus Pocus fans like myself, you have the Hocus Pocus Black Flame Petite Cake Devil's Food Biscuit. I. Devil's Food Biscuit, never heard of that. Apricot jam, brandy simple syrup, caramel mousse, and candied pecan crunch, or pecan, if you say pecan. $22, that looks really cool though. But why isn't the candle black? I thought the candle was black. I, I might have to you know, re-watch Hocus Pocus. Let me know in the comments if you remember it being black, because I swear the candle was actually black with a black flame. What do I know though? And here it is in its glory. It does look really cool. It does look really cool. I like it. What do you think, Queen? You like it? Yeah, I like it. I think it's cool. I gotta say though, I really like that one on the right. I, I've shown it before. And I just, it looks so cool. Like, it looks like a geode. 
So we're leaving Amaretz now, and I gotta say, I'm a little surprised at the lack of fall type items that they had in there today. We didn't show anything else because they didn't really have anything else that was fall. Like a lot of times they had the uh, Mickey pumpkin dome cake and things like that. The only thing they had was that um, the black flame candle. So I was actually kind of surprised. I wonder if they'll have more for Christmas. We'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see. Right, Queen? Oh yeah, definitely. We'll wait and see. Queen, I really want to go into the world of Disney because I know they have Halloween fall stuff. Should we go? Focus, focus. No, no, you're right. You're focused. That, that'll be for a different vlog. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. So we figured since, you know, it's towards Halloween, Goofy's Candy Company, let's see what they got inside of the store. Let's go. Right away, these tents, they're hot chocolate, but look, they're all Halloween fall inspired. And look at this. They actually have real candy corn. Some of these we've noticed have um, gummy candy corn. Ooh, this is Mickey. I didn't know. Oh, they Minnie candy. has the. I think Minnie has the gummy ones. Oh, these one have candy corn. That both of them have regular yeah. candy corn. Okay, very cool. And I like the. Uh, I like the new things that they have. They're not just little plastic containers. You can like make little ornaments for your Halloween tree. And they have some beautiful cupcakes here in the case. Oh man, they look gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Some spooky candy apples. Oh, they look awesome. I love the Jack Skellington. The Mickey pumpkin, so good. And they have these beautiful cookies. I think we're gonna get the candy corn colored one. Cause I have to. I think they're the same flavor, but I just want the candy corn looking one. And just in case Rice Krispies are your jam, little Jack Skellington, a pumpkin rice crispy, oh. And down here, the mummy. Is that a rice crispy? I can't tell. I think it is. But they got a mummy Mickey. Say that 10 times fast. So we went ahead and got the candy corn colored cookie. It looks awesome. And, and I'll just tell you guys, these cookies in general, I've said it many times in the past, one of the best bargains, it's like five bucks for the yes. cookie. You and it's huge. You can feed a family of four with it. You really can. You really can. You just want to like, you know, get it, just to wet your beak a little bit. It does. It looks so pretty. Both of those, the other one that was like a spider, spider web, looked really yes. pretty too. Hi, Juice. Take a bite. Yeah, I can take a bite. Mm. Mm. These cookies never let me down. Mm. And it's just like a regular sugar cookie um, with a nice icing over it. It doesn't taste like candy corn, uh, but that's okay. This just tastes delicious. It's good. It just tastes delicious. So if you like, if you like a, a sugar cookie, yeah. you're gonna like this. Would you get it again? Every single time I will get one of these cookies. Mm -hmm. Thumbs up. I booped it. And let's see what kind of spooky offerings they have here at Salt and Straw, an amazing ice cream parlor here in the West End in Disney Springs. They always have really, really funky, odd, off the wall type stuff and just your regular run of the mill vanilla and chocolate. But let's check out what they got. Guys, so the ice cream series here at Salt and Straw. Check this out, they have the ice cream series, the Great Candy Copia, homemade Kit Kats, Reese's, Snickers, Heath Bars, oh my goodness. Dawn Baguita, Bugitos, Creepy Crawly Critters. You have matcha ice cream, which is so good, with mealworms and chocolate crickets. Yes, real bugs. Oh, I would totally do that. I'm gonna have to come back for that. The Jack-O-Lantern Pumpkin Bread. Black Cat Licorice and Lavender Double Bubble Toil and Trouble. But I'll tell you, I, I gotta do it just because it's so off the wall, man. We're gonna have to come back for that. So I know I've been asking you guys to you know leave a comment about things. I feel like at least throughout this vlog. But I really wanna know, is there anybody else out there that would also try the bug ice cream other than me? Queen, would you try the bug ice cream? 
Yes. <laughs> <laughs> she would. I like that. Good answer. Good answer. But yeah, leave a comment too. If you guys would try it or if you wouldn't. I'm, I'm just curious to see. Let us know. Let who us dares. know. Yeah, who dares. dares to try the bug ice cream? All right, guys. So that is going to do it for our vlog. Uh, we hope you enjoyed it. And we are just showing you guys some items that they have for fall offerings down here at Disney Springs. Hopefully you can get down here and try some of them as well. Uh, just be forewarned on that purple cheesecake. <laughs> Dole Whip. Dole Whip. It yeah. just it, it just didn't work for me. Yeah, but let us know guys if you guys try it and you guys like it. Maybe yeah. You guys like it. Maybe you'll like it. I don't know. Or but maybe we got a maybe maybe we, we got a bad, maybe we got a bad batch. Maybe and I can't wait for Bad Batch, the, the series, the Star Wars series. But that's focus, a whole focus, that's focus, a whole yeah, focus. focus. That's a whole nother thing. But guys, thank you so much. Uh, if you did enjoy the vlog, we hope you consider subscribing to our channel and booping that like button. Uh, helps out immensely. But thank you so much. Until we see you next time, remember, only one way to live. In the, In the moment. moment! Don't forget to check out any of these videos. Yes, the Joffrey's one.